James Burroughs has been a nearly constant presence in your living room for more than 40 years. He directs sitcoms. I've directed 1,050 episodes of television. I also have 1,050 stories and situations that happened to me over this time. You stink. Sitcoms your parents and grandparents loved. I need a loose crew, Mary. <laughs> Ted, if you don't have a loose screw, nobody does. <laughs> Taxi. You should see what's written about you on the walls of the ladies' room. I know what it says in there. I wrote it. And cheers. Afternoon, everybody. Hey! And a lot of the ones you grew up with. Okay, I'll go out with you. Yes! Frazier. My wife had left me, which was very painful. Then she came back to me, which was excruciating. And friends. You can have the last piece if you want. Well, I should think so. You slept with someone. And oh, yes, does he have stories to tell. How did the people in the cast of Friends early on feel about each other? So they're all six kids that were under 30 when they were cast. They were all very nice, sweet people. And as it is when I do a show, especially with a cast of unknowns, it's my job to make them like one another, and dare I say, love one another. Love, says Burroughs, is a difference maker. Because if they feel that way about one another, that's going to come across the screen. See? He's her lobster. It sure did. Before the show even aired, he chartered a plane and took the young cast to Las Vegas. I said, guys, I just want you to know that this is your last shot at anonymity. You will never be able to sit in a restaurant or walk through a casino without being mauled once this show goes on the air. Directed by James Burroughs has anecdotes aplenty, but it is also a how-to manual for sitcom success. You talk about casting, and you talked about different people who came in and you knew instantly. How did you know? Sometimes you know by the fact that the 10 people who came before them were no good. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, folks. When Deborah Messing started a reading with Eric, we knew. Because chemistry happened. It was chemistry. Will, what are you doing? I think you've sprung a leak. What are you talking about? <gasps> Grace! Chemistry and the believability of one actor, yes. one character. <laughs> what is the center? The center is the windows that the audience sees the show with. It was Mary, it was Newhart, it was Judd Hirsch on Taxi, it was Teddy Danson, it was Eric McCormick, it was Kelsey Grammer. That's the center of the show. The center is the person who talks to the crazy people so it allows you to accept the crazy people. The, the center believes that this person has merit. Guess who we are? Uh, a Catholic girl gone bad. <laughs> and Karen, what are you supposed to be? <laughs> lots and lots of Emmys, accolades, the respect and affection of his casts. Yet Burroughs let one or two shows get away, including Seinfeld. I did the ones I wanted to do. Yeah. And they turned out okay. I, it seems to. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. God. If you cut to the view of the backyard, you'll see how well it turned out. <laughs> Caught it. Let's do it. James Burroughs has indeed prospered. Action! But those nights of back to back to back sitcoms are long gone. Are the days of the sitcom, are, are they over? Uh, I've attended the funeral for the sitcom a number of times. They've never put the casket in the ground. You were the right place at the right time. I know. I know. <laughs> I was very lucky. It was the golden years. God. Wow. Uh, right? Wow. So, really great read. Amazing read. He talks about, I want my people to go out to the end of the plank. Go to the very end of the plank. Mm -hmm. And if you fall out, I promise I'll catch you. Mm. Right? And so that's, he gets these yep. amazing performances. One more thing I want to read from the book. I believe that kindness is the most important currency you can have, can trade in, in business and in art. Mm -hmm. So he's like this super mensch, an amazing career. He's and, so beloved. When yeah. you hear some of these actors yeah. talk mm -hmm. about yeah. him, they revere him. Mm -hmm. He's and like I, they're a father figure. Yeah. Yeah. Without question. And not a bad backyard. I was going to say, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was going to say, I was going to thought I was watching <laughs> Selling Sunset. <laughs> <laughs> Very, Very thank you.
Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.